Hello everybody, welcome back to the world of me. My name's Cougar and this is another episode from the Amazon review series. Of course have another package in today. And uh, that is right here. And as you can see, this is a 10 inch LED ring light. Uh, I got this because I want to expand upon some of the options I have in terms of being able to record. And uh, so let's check it out and see what we've got inside. All right, so here we go. This is everything that's in the box. And as you can see, there's some paperwork and then there's some pieces to the devices. Uh, let's just kind of hit the paperwork real quick. There is a simple thank you card from, uh, from uh, it's Powshore. I believe is how it's pronounced and then they just have a little thing on the back that says whether you like it or not. Uh, we have a little really small sheet for instructions and then here is a more full uh, instruction set and uh, this manual has uh, all the information on how it's used and uh, what you can do with it and things like that. Uh, and then it of course folds out. Uh, next thing we've got right here is, as you can see, this is a phone mount. Uh, you can, of course, put this on a uh, shoe, a hot shoe, a uh, cold shoe, whichever, uh, for your cameras. So you can actually put this to uh, most uh, photo cameras, have those uh, mounts for your flashes and things of that sort. And this will, of course, mount to those. It does extend out. So you can put a pretty decent sized phone in there. I believe that goes out roughly to, I think that's about four, four and a half inches, uh, roughly, that it'll go out to. So you can get a pretty decent sized phone in there or small tablet even, um, phablet, I guess is what they also call them. And uh, this does just screw in. You can, of course, put it in on the vertical axis. As you can see on the back though, it does have uh, a screw back there so you can put it on the horizontal axis. So if you wanted to stand it up like this and have the phone facing up or down, uh, you don't have to bend the thing all over. You can keep that uh, balance point, that axis, uh, directly in line instead of having to flip it all the way over and hoping that your legs are gonna hold it up. That's a really nice um, kind of uh, option right there. Uh, the next thing we've got is a very simple tripod. As you can see, it spreads out quite a bit here. Uh, it goes nice and wide, but it has a little bit of stiffness, so you can sit here and adjust it and get it a little higher. The nice thing I do like about this is, uh, this is fairly heavy, and that's because this entire thing is metal. There isn't any plastic on it other than the rubber tips here, which of course will help give you a better uh, grip on you know certain surfaces. Uh, you do of course have the quarter inch screw in right there, which is pretty standard for any type of uh, photography equipment. And then it uses an Allen wrench there. Uh, so of course it's screwed into the base and I'm sure it's screwed in there pretty tight. And then you can sit there and screw on your other pieces. You could actually screw your phone directly into this probably, uh, you know, if you, if you so needed to. But uh, next thing we've got here is we actually have a little remote and uh, the remote does also come with its own instructions, even though they are mentioned in there. Um, oh, again, we have the little fold out, and I think that's the same thing as what that other one is. Uh, looks pretty much the same. But we have, uh, it has two kind of modes. You have uh, the camera, let's see, camera 360, and then it also says iOS. And then we've got uh, another one, which is, oh, it says Android, okay. Um, and it's in that broken up lettering that Android uses. So uh, these are both sets so that you can use them with uh, Bluetooth. And uh, if you have one of those maybe 360 cameras, I do have ones that uh, use very similar uh, little uh, remotes like this. It does have a little side switch there, and then it does have that little loop at the bottom that you can put a simple lanyard on if you so wish. And let's see, we get to the guts of it, which is this right here. This is a 10 inch uh, LED ring light. Uh, obviously when you mount this, which this is set up so that it will take the camera or the phone holder there, and it has a little notch at the back that it slides right into, and then you can just screw that down. And now you can take and record your videos and everything, and you've got the light shining 
all the way around your uh, around your things. Uh, if you watch some of the videos out there, I know ones that you can see it a lot on are, uh, if you're on TikTok, for example, uh, a lot of people use these kind of ring lights and you can really see it like, um, if you happen to look at their eyes, you can see the ring on their eyes because of course, obviously their eyes reflect the light. And uh, so it's very common to be used for things like that. For a lot of the uh, close-up facial shots and stuff like that, obviously this isn't huge. Uh, I mean, with only being 10 inches, so you're not gonna take really distant kind of pictures with this. This is gonna be for more of a portrait type mode or anything like that. It does have, of course, the ball pivot right there, which then tightens up with the, uh, with the nut right there. And it also has the, uh, the screw-in mount at the bottom there. So you can, of course, take your mount, screw it in. And once you've got that in place, you can then position your head, tighten it down, and then everything is solid and secure. Now, another thing is, is that this is USB powered. So you could simply plug this into a, uh, well, you could plug it into a laptop or a computer if you have one of those nearby. Uh, the other thing obviously is you can use one of those simple little power banks. And then you also have the little remote that's in line with the cord here. And the remote will increase, it has uh, plus and minus buttons, as well as a little toggle type button and an on and off button. The uh, plus and minus, of course, increase and decrease your lighting. The toggle button will actually change the coloring. Uh, you can get different color temperatures, and that's actually what this is uh, here for. And I don't know if you can quite see that very well, but we have a very bright white, we have kind of a dingy white, and then we have more of a yellow, uh, kind of a soft white light that this is able to produce. Uh, I think we should check this out and uh, maybe take a picture or do a quick video just with this and we can kind of see what it looks like and see what the colors look like. Uh, if you guys would like to check this out, of course, I will have a link to this down there in the description below uh, to the Amazon site. And also while you're down there, don't forget to check out my social media. And uh, also there is that uh, PayPal link that's down there. Uh, that is of course in place of Patreon. If you guys like this, I wouldn't mind if you'd give it a thumbs up while you're on your way down or on your way back up as well. If you haven't done so already, hit that subscribe button and uh, ring that little bell so you know when we've got new videos coming out here on World of Me. All right, everybody. Well, my name's Cougar. This is the World of Me, another episode from the Amazon Review Series. I'd like to wish you all a good day, and I will see you later. Bye.